What's happening guys, it's B-Rad and well, we are bringing it back to a series that I have neglected on my channel admittedly, but we are bringing it back in a big way. It is not just a foot eliminator, this is a budget builder foot eliminator. The creator of Budget Builder Face Off is my opponent in this series and it is Merzgoff. How are you doing buddy? I'm not doing too badly. I feel at the moment I'm in a slightly better position, I feel. I would not disagree. I mean, what has happened basically, guys, is we have done the first part of this episode over on Merzgoff's channel, okay? So, first of all, right now, pause this video and go and check out the first part because otherwise, some of this isn't going to make sense. There's squad building requirements. There's an 85 times 10 pack on the both of us. So, there's things that you definitely want to see. But essentially, we have our teams in front of us and there are bronze players in the team now the portion of foot eliminator that we are now going to do is the three guesses at the positions in there now where this usually differs from um foot eliminator is obviously we'd have had a squad build we'd have had certain requirements and all that kind of stuff and we'd pick a marquee player second player player to save in this one we're only going to take away because we've already got bronzes we're only going to take away our marquee player and the player we packed. So we're not taking three. There's no safety net in this one. Because we've already got bronzers in the team. However, if those bronzers get hit, they are going to change into trump cards. So, without any further delay, I'm going to put Cantona on the bench. And this episode is around the Man United version of Cantona. So we're flashing it back to his days at Man United. And I'm going to put Eden Hazard, spoiler alert, the player I packed in my 85 times 10. Yourself, Merz? I have uh, put my Cantona down and it was Charles Gill that I picked from my 85 plus times 10. Yes, indeed. So what's going to happen now, guys? We are going to shuffle up our team. We're going to get three guesses each at positions in our respective formations. If a player gets hit, we will remove that player to the reserves bench and we will say hit until the end we won't give away who that is because it might give an inkling to our opponent as to where we have moved some players so shall we give them a jumble yes let's do that i mean at this point right now obviously you've lost a center back i've lost my striker my only striker if either of us lose our goalie at this point which mers is completely renowned for doing um we're in trouble i think that's a tr tricky situation right now it is indeed i am as jumbled as i'm gonna be as i am i so would you like to go first with your pick or second i will go second okay so mers has opted for the four triple two formation i know that he has two players obviously on the bench two spots but those two are not in your right centre back. That is a hit. Stick that player on the reserves bench. We've got one. We've got one. Um, let's go with your right cam. That is a miss. <sighs> Come on. Can we... If I only lose one player from this, I'll be absolutely delighted. I'm going to go for your left CDM. That is a hit. Come on, two for two, baby. Go with your right back. That, unfortunately, is a hit. Still one more spot where you could get another miss for me. There's two spots for a miss, and I'm going to go for one of the striker spots, and I feel like you would definitely have left one of them open. I'm going to go right striker. That is a hit. Hit? Yes, three for three. Come on, then. Get this final miss, Merz, and let's get it out of the way. Uh, go with your left centre-back. 
Oh, yeah, that is a hit. It's not a good one because it is my... One of my CDMs, which is quite important in this game, I feel. Um, okay, I'll let you know the damage first. You hit Mailer at the right back. He was still at right back. And you hit Fred, the red. So, yeah, okay. yeah I got him. Well, my uh, midfield has been absolutely decimated. Oh, okay. Bernardo Silva, Sissoko, and Varane. Oh, okay. So, neither of us hit any of the bronzers. So, there are no trump cards in this, but we do have a matter of figuring out some chemistry. So, we'll be back to show you the completed teams once we've found some players that give chem. Well, okay, so what we have in front of you now are the completed teams. Now, yes, you will see that I do have a gold mailer at right back. It's because there's literally nobody that could give Delaney and Kalulu the chem they need. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take him out and sub him straight away for our good friend, Mr. Tang Wang Song. He will be featuring at right back. Uh, I've then had to put this guy Wiggett in at left back and Clarkson in to get some chemistry there. Clarkson's off chemistry, but he's a bronze anyway, so it doesn't matter. And then obviously I've got Salazar from Merza's episode up front. I've then got Bernardo Silva on the bench because any player that you hit can be on the bench in case you get any injuries. I don't have any of the other two in the club, but we don't tend to get more than one touch wood. Um, so who have you got there, Merz? Okay, so uh, at the right centre back slot, I have got Rissacassens, a Spanish centre back, because he will help get a link to my silver CDM from the MLS, who is Oriel Rossell. Okay. And I've got a West Ham French player at CDM by the name of Equa. Limby, and then uh left cam i've got a man city player robertson english player uh all gets okay. nice all chem on my team no need to sub on anybody i don't have fred in my club so i'm not going to worry about going out and buying that and i don't really care too much about the right back who's only 82 rated yep no fair enough yeah. so these are the teams we've got. We're going to go into a normal game, so no max chemistry or anything here. And obviously at the end, the gold difference will equal discards on the squad. So let's get into the game. Right, here we go into the game then. As promised, obviously I will be making my sub to get Mr. Tan Wang Song on for Mailer. So that is done. And let's get into the game. Good luck, buddy. Good luck. What a save. Way offside. What? Uh, that's a goal. What? Don't think that was offside. Wow. Somebody was probably playing him onside. Wow. I was sure that was offside. Gonna have to watch that again. Salazar with an assist somehow. Oh yeah, your um, whoever that is, Cancelo. Yeah, was playing him on. My goodness. That is all the stamina from my bronze gone. Try to keep up with him. I don't know what happened, but I was trying to tell Gil to uh, do get away from the ball. Pushed the ball ahead of him so he could do a proper sprint to get away from the player, but he wasn't doing it. Is that that man again? He actually feels really good. I've not used him this year, but he's good. That he was obviously giving me my um, strong link to Martial, who's not so far been missed. Oh, nice. Nice. There we go. Yeah! Come on. Got a 
keep those discards to a minimum. Got to save Cantona. Yeah. Big hands from Handanovic. And Cantona rises. To the occasion. Who's your Annoyingly, it's my two centre backs, and my two centre backs are meant to be really good. Oh, that's, that's way over, Cantona. You don't know, at least had that lower. That is a conversion right there. Oh, Salazar. You let me down. Just bypass the midfield, shall we? That oh. Actually, it seems like a good idea. Oh, but now I'm back. Uh, yeah. I've got to go to <laughs> <laughs> that was a good idea, and then you went backwards. <laughs> oh, no. Well, very even, Keel. Yeah. Oh, I've had wow. a few more shots, but XG is not far off. Only 0.7 difference. Second half. Here we go. Let's do this. Oh, wow. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. That, that, that's acceptable. Had to do it. Yeah, I mean, he knew, he knew that the player threw on goal was Salazar. There weren't no danger. Oh. Yeah, oh, he feels incredible. He feels incredible. The little duck and dive and smashed into the far right hand corner. A hat trick for Roni Rona. <laughs> oh, he saw his name in lights and he absolutely cacked it. Come on. Oh. Come on. Oh, I'll take that. I'll take that. I'll take Come that. on. Thank you. And uh, with no hands. Just handed it straight back to you is what he did. Yeah. Oh, come on. Nice. Yes. Near post, Cantona. Don't... Right now, midfield. Don't let me down. Okay, Q. Oh my God. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. As what? Well, as soon as he m was past that midfield and then just burst away from Kunde, that was it. That midfield is is they've lost all stamina. Oh, come oh. on, Andanovic. <laughs> You're giving away right. two goals. Oh, my God. I've got to fucking defend the kickoff now. No. <laughs> Thank you. Well, Andanovic, you, you've, you've let me down there, mate. You've let your side down. And if you get discarded, then it's only your fault. Come on, Eric. Four goals. Taking the man of the match. That doesn't surprise me for you. Yeah, he did. He come up clutch for you. Unfortunately, not yep. for me. However, Mr. Rona, he is a good player. I would like to use him again in the future. But Mers does have one discard on my team. Now, if I'm honest, there's two players, obviously, I don't want to see go. And that is probably Hazard and Cantona. Mm -hmm. But he's only got one pick. So do the worst, mate. Do your worst. It is mixed up. Let's go. I want to say straight down the middle, but I feel like that's just going to be way too big. Central cam. So I am going to say right CDM. Oh, God. What is it? Central cam would have been Rona. I didn't actually move him of anybody, but the person I did move from left cam to right CDM 
is King Eric. Well. Well, well, well. What a fitting end to the episode. I am going to go against what some people might want here, maybe, and I'm going to go and put him into the final part I have left to do for Footy's Neymar. Now, some of you might be annoyed at that, but let me bear in mind one thing to you guys. Cantona is in my starting team. He has played 118 games for me, scored 49 goals. 118 games for me is a lot because I probably only played about 300 over the whole year. Let's go get him into an SBC. We'll be back when I'm ready to submit. Right, so here we go then. As promised, Eric Cantona is going in to the final 89 rated squad for Neymar. Along with some other players, I've got a duplicate Camavinga and Acuna from that 85 times 10. So they're going in. Some high gold rares there and other tots. But essentially, he is gone. Now, I have got Neymar here who I am doing an episode with with my other fellow FSB creators. And if you're not familiar with the FSB creators, go to my links down below. We have podcast that you need to be listening to. But also, we have just done, and it will have expired by now, we have just done a FIFA 23 giveaway. We are small content creators, but we do provide giveaways. So you need to make sure you're subscribed to us because you never know. You might win yourself some FIFA points in the future. But if not, you'll at least get to listen to our fantastic Three for Tears podcast. There is Neymar. I mean, he looks incredible. I can't wait to use him against Luke in the video. Um, but I'm sad to see Mr. Cantonar go. He has played a lot of games for my team. And I'm now going to have to completely rework my team um, from where he was. So thank you for that, Merz. No problem. I'm glad that I hit the big boy with just one one pick. I can't believe it. I, I do. You know what? I, I blame Handanovic wholeheartedly. To be fair, I should have stuck him in this I SBC. Um, yeah, he made a couple of very vital errors at the end there. But like I said, this is a two-part episode, so you need to go and check out the first part of Merza's video for this all to make sense. Go and show him some love, subscribe, and all that good stuff. We have been part of the FSB creators doing a collaboration video for you guys. Thank you ever so much for tuning in. I've been Brad.